Developing right now in Orlando, jail time for a former Orlando police officer. Yeah, in just the last couple of hours, a judge handed down the sentence. It came after that former officer took the stand today. The judge sentenced Peter Delio to 51 weeks in jail, followed by probation for this incident in 2014. Video showing him kneeing a man in the stomach. That man later had surgery for a ruptured spleen. News 6 reporter Brittany Harris was in the courtroom this afternoon. She joins us now live. And Brittany, we understand that Delio got emotional on the stand today. That's right, Ginger. Peter Delio did get a little emotional as he talked about what happened. And while apologizing to Robert Lee, the man you saw there in that video, Delio says he didn't mean any harm. Peter Delio sat quietly in the courtroom as both his parents testified on his behalf. The former Orlando police officer is awaiting sentencing after a jury found him guilty of felony battery for kneeing this man, Robert Lease, in the stomach. Lease was handcuffed in a holding cell at the time and later needed surgery for a ruptured spleen. Please do not let his stoic appearance lead you to believe that he is not deeply sorry for the injury that he caused Mr. Lease. We all are. He's not a cruel man. He's not, a, he's not an unjust man. It, 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 it just was, a, he was just in the wrong place at the right time. Delio also took the stand, saying he never meant any harm and feels sick when he sees the video. I understand why the jury made the decision they did. It's clear to me why they did. I was wrong and I caused your injury, sir, and I am deeply sorry that I did and that you had to suffer through that. The defense attorney and prosecutor spent a long time debating over what kind of punishment Delio deserves, but the judge ultimately decided to sentence him to 51 weeks in county jail, followed by probation. He'll also have to attend anger management class and pay restitution. And we did try to talk to Delio's family as they were leaving the courtroom today. They were obviously very upset about the situation and declined to do an interview. We also asked Robert Lee if he'd like to talk, and he declined an interview as well. Back to you.